Hey guys, Ava here. Today I'm on the set of Bunked with... Karen Barrar. <laughs> and this is On The Spot Interviews. It is so great to see you again. You're still one of my favorite people to talk to. So Aww, thank you. That means a lot. <laughs> thank you. I know it's a different feel. Like, you were here last year and there was a penthouse and now it's a whole nother debacle with a camp now. <laughs> yes. Wait, so this is the same uh, set? Same stage. Same, same exact stage. So we pretty much, uh, we had to tear down the penthouse sets. I know, they're in like storage somewhere in Burbank, I think. <laughs> they like always say the sets like just in case. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, and then we just, they rolled this up and uh, I like, it's overwhelmingly huge. Yeah, it is huge. I take it you guys can't even have live audiences. Or can you? We can't. Unfortunately we can't, like that's the downside to it. It's like, we can't bring fans in to exactly like see the whole set, mm -hmm. but occasionally you know we get to bring family friends in who get oh, to see the nice. set. And you know, usually they're expecting because they haven't seen any of the episodes of Bunked. They're mm -hmm. expecting a penthouse, and we're like, uh, could you take a camp? Yeah. <laughs> if you read the synopsis, you would know people. No, I'm totally kidding. I'm not that sassy. <laughs> Snap. <laughs> so uh, Ravi on Jesse was you know kind of the nerdy one, kind of the clueless one, I guess. Yes, I can so say nice. that because it's not actually you. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. Please. <laughs> so uh, how? How is Ravi kind of growing up um, in the camp? I think he's definitely learning to adapt to different types of people. Because at camp, you get to meet kids from all across the U.S. or mm -hmm. even sometimes all across the world. And I think what's so cool about this camp is that, you know, in Manhattan, there's a lot of, you know, a lot of crazy people, a lot of cool people, oh, okay. tons of personalities. And I think, you know, Ravi was his own uh, definite personality. And this time, he's going to adjust to different ones and, you know, make more friends. Mm -hmm. Well, that's awesome. And... You know, in Manhattan, you guys were like the rich family, whatnot, very spoiled. Uh, do you guys kind of regain that humility back at camp? Because it's, you know, it's camp. You're not in a penthouse. You're in, like, bunks. Exactly, right? It's, um, I think it brings us to a more humble feel. Because even though we were in a penthouse, we were uh, still able uh, to have kids relate to us. And we, likewise, we could relate to certain kids, and um, we were able to make that connection. And I think over here with this camp, I feel like pants will, uh, pants, parents... Uh, will be able to, you know, relate to the show and be like, oh, I used to do this at camp. And kids themselves will be able to, we have some amazing characters that are uh, being introduced to the story, and they'll definitely be able to relate to these new characters as well as us. Awesome. Well, I can't wait, and hopefully I won't cry too hard because I had great memories at camp, and the nostalgia is real. Um, right, just bring, yeah. back the, just bring back the memories and the feels. Yeah. Oh, it's, it was a great time, though. So have you ever been to camp, and if so, any experience that stood out to you? Way back when, in fifth grade. <laughs> oh, this was a while ago. Uh, no, it was just uh, about like five years ago that we had this uh, fifth grade uh, camp trip that we uh, took this camp in Seattle, Washington. I originally grew up in Seattle, Washington. And um, it was the best experience of my life. It was only two days. I'd never been camping before, but it was so much fun because I love the feel of being in a cabin with your best friends and, you know, uh, spending the day just having fun in the outdoors. It is truly the best experience I have. And being able to kind of like semi-recreate it on a soundstage is awesome. I mean, if you can't go back to the actual thing, you might as well do the series, right? Right, exactly. It might as, I think, like, even though the camp's split in half, like, it still, it still does the same. It still has the same effect, right? There's just a canoe laying around. It's chairs. It's the same thing. <laughs> yeah, this set is amazing. Now, which one is your room? Uh, so our cabin is Grizzly Cabin over okay. there. So that's uh, Kevin Quinn and Nathan Arenas are... Um, and me are in that uh, cabin with Miss Kipling and over there even though she's a girl uh, and over there is the woodchuck cabin where uh, Emma um, Lou and Zuri are staying at and right back here is where Hazel is um, at the weasel cabin so these are just three of many many uh, cabins uh, set up throughout. <laughs> yeah, well, they look like super real. It's super cool. Right? <laughs> yeah. This is like a very, you know, realistic looking set. So do you have a favorite room uh, besides this one to film in? Ooh, um, I, my favorite room is the mess hall because there's a pool table there. So whenever I get the chance, like if some, uh, sometimes Miranda and I, like we, uh, we have to drive pretty far to get here. So sometimes we'll get here early and what we'll do is we'll actually play pool <laughs> before anyone gets here. So we'll play pool for a little bit. Okay. Yeah. You got to take a break from working and, you know, just let loose. Right. So good for you. Oh, thank you. Of course. And, um, lastly, I know there's like 17 media outlets here. Um, <laughs> Uh, you are, the show's premiering end of this month, Disney Channel. Um, why should people tune in? 
Um, I think it's um, the original fans of Jesse um, have loved Jesse from the beginning, and I think they're going to love uh, Bunt even more because we have the same people working on it and some amazing creative episodes and some more characters everyone's going to love. Okay, well, I will definitely tune in. As I told Nina, it is a great way to end the month of July. Oh, thank you so of much. Course. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Anytime, and thank you so much, and I hope to see you soon. Oh, same here. Thank, thank you so much.